jetzt geht's weiter. Your sister said he was building an army. We can thank Mira, it's not larger. But we'll lose if we go up against that. He doesn't expect us to. He's trying to frighten us into surrender. I want every bolt aimed at Lord Whitehill the moment he appears. Lord Whitehill. Ryan. My Ryan. Ryan. Crossbows up! Asher Forrester! Show your face, boy! I must tactic vorgehen. Ryan! He's frightened, father. On ya! <laughs> well, Lord, you must not have much faith in this army of yours if you feel the need to hide by my little brother. <laughs> you mistake me, Forrester. Ryan is here for your protection, to stop you from being stupid. You see, I'm here to end this once and for all. You got your little revenge on my men, but it's time you listen to reason. Oh, we're pushing. I could ram your gates down and kill every last one of you. Or we could oh, end wow. the bloodshed here and now. So this war there? is over, Asher. It ended the moment Roderick fell. By Ramsay's rules, I'm the victor here. This will all be mine now. One way or another. Oh, this is horse shit. Tell him to fuck off. Are you truly that blind lord? I am the lord of House Forrester! <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> He's the fourth Lord Forrester. I've seen in his many moons, father. <laughs> Let's put all this ugliness behind us. I'm willing to talk terms of your surrender. Surrender? Open your halls and bend the knee as my bannermen. You continue to produce ironwood under my supervision, of course. Some shanker, and you will join so. your house to mine, for all to see, by wedding my Quinn. Quinn? <laughs> well, fuck me. Asher, you can't! It's rather generous terms, actually. That would be easier to believe coming from Quinn herself. Where is she? Far away from all this, of course. Besides, I speak on her behalf as her father. I would just as happily kill you all and be done with it. But I'm very generously giving you a way to keep your bloody lives. Oh, one last thing. As a show of my goodwill, I've brought home the body of your lord. Loser. Your brother was too stubborn to know when it was over. Roderick, let me see him. I want to see my brother. <clears throat> I'm sure your people will be relieved to keep their lives. We'll take Ryan too. But you want peace between our houses? Give me my living brother. You have an hour. I'll be waiting in my camp. Ja, mieser, mieser Typ. Zum Schein würde ich ihm sogar den Thron geben. Wir können ihn aus dem Hinterhalt angreifen. Kann man irgendwie diese Option wählen? Roderick. Mein Bruder.
I'm sorry, little brother. It's tut me auch leid. Ruhe in Frieden. I've buried too many sons. Maester, take my brother's body. He will join Father and Ethan in the grove. As you say, my lord. But forgive me, I I just Perhaps the time has come to truly let this bloodshed end. We simply accept. We bow our heads and Asher marries Gwyn. Craven! It's not the worst terms I've ever heard. I may have loved Gwyn once, but this isn't real. That Lord will have my head the moment Gwyn produces an heir. There will be no marriage. If we bow our heads now, we'll always be his slaves. We have to kill them, Asher. I piss on surrender. Let's ride out and kill them all. Aye. We ride for war! We ride! Spill their blood! Believe me, I want to kill every last fucking one of them. But Lord still has Ryan. A direct attack is a sure way to see another forester dead today. But... There may be another way we could win this. Lord rules that house with an iron fist. His sons, his bannermen, do nothing without his say-so. There may be 500 men outside that wall. Without Lord of the League... They'll scatter like chickens with their heads cut off. That's good, but how? Lud will not simply cast aside his men and offer his neck. Such a task is easily said, but Lud is wary. Simple. We tell Lord exactly what he wants to hear. We invite him inside to celebrate and drink to our union. And then? Then an ambush. Your pit fighters strike from the shadows. No, an ambush is too chaotic. Things could go badly quickly. Lord could escape. There's another way. Poison. In his wine. A woman's weapon. Yes, and a good one. Lethal and direct. Either plan is a high risk. We only lure Lud inside if the whole family is there to sell it. Talia and Ryan will both be in danger. I'll be there, Roiland. I'll pour the wine myself. Hey, Poison is name. dog shit. You're here for revenge. You want him to choke on your blade, not his vomit. Sure I good. understand what's at stake. But Poison is the surest way to see Lord dead. Then we have a plan. Whatever happens to me, I need you to get Ryan out alive. As soon as we move on, Lord. Not a problem. You know you're the only family I've ever had. That makes Ryan my brother, too. I won't forget this. I've forgotten the number of times I've heard you say that. I've said that before. We will avenge Roderick's death tonight, whatever it takes. Send word to Lud. We'll drink this night to the prosperous future of our united houses. She's left the keep! Search the area! Lady Mira! There she is! Take her! What's all this? Lord Morgren. How lovely to run into you. Mira Forrester, you're coming with us. <clears throat> My good sirs, there's no need for that. Surely you have more dangerous criminals to deal with than Lady Marjorie's handmaiden. We have orders from Captain Lucan Let to... Let me worry about Lucan. You worry about buying yourselves a few tankards. 
on me. Thank you for keeping our city safe. Can I take you somewhere, Lady Mary? Ich vertraue ihm nicht. The Rivergate. Thank you. The Rivergate. Quick as you can. What's going on, Mera? Is there a problem? Maybe I can help. Minor trouble, Lord Morgren. Nothing I can't deal with. Of course. I never doubted that. Although those guards did seem quite intent on dragging you off. Clearly you've made powerful enemies here in King's Landing. Although, you've made short work of one of them, at least. I hear Lord Andros has found a home in the Black Cells. I'm impressed. It seems he took on the wrong handmaiden and lost. Oh, come, come. Don't be modest. It's something to be proud of. Of course. Now that you've gotten rid of my biggest competitor, all kinds of opportunities have opened up. Particularly in your part of the Seven Kingdoms. The Ironwood market is wide open. A lot of gold to be made. There's opportunity enough for both of us, Lord Morgren. Think of what we could accomplish if we work together. <laughs> I have thought about it. I've thought about it a great deal. You're clever, Mira. Getting that decree from Tyrion's chambers, I still wonder how you managed such a feat. Of course, I knew you'd be a problem when we first met. Imagine, a handmaiden stealing the Crown's ironwood contract from under my nose. That's why I bribed that Lannister guard to kill you. Don't look so surprised. You must have known you'd become a target sooner or later. I knew it! I never should have trusted you! Of course not. You should never trust anyone in King's Landing. That might have been your only mistake. But a costly one. After Lud takes Ironrath, he and I will control the Ironwood trade entirely. You've been very helpful, Mira. But it's time to get you out of the way. Can't have you complicating things. You're making a mistake, Morgren. I have powerful allies. One word to Cersei, and you'll be in the cell next to Andros. You're mistaken, Mira Forrester. No one is coming to your aid. arrived. Now get out of my fucking litter! Lucan, I fancy coming across you here. I seem to have found something you are looking for. That you have, my lord. I've been searching for this murderer a long time. Finally, I got her. You don't need to do this, Lucan. Whatever you think you know, we, we can work something out. Shut your liar's mouth! It's time you answered for your crimes. Take her to the cells. Chin up, Mira. I'm sure if you ask him nicely, the headsman will be quick. Forgive my brother's temper. It's said over time, wargs adopt the traits of their animals. And your news was... unexpected. You see, Gregor Forrester was our father. And we are his bastards. I doubt anyone knows. It was his dark secret. And he feared his family would find out. No one at Ironraft knows of this. Not that I've ever heard. I suspected as much. Josra would say he banished us to hide his shame. 
But I like to think it's because he knew what we were, that he was protecting us in his own way. We thought one day Gregor would come and see everything we've built. But instead it was you. You are the first to arrive. It must have been a difficult journey. Few try, and fewer still live to tell about it. I wouldn't have made it alone. I had help from my friend, Cotter, and, and Sylvie. But they were following your lead. You were the one who was sent by House Forrester. Our father entrusted us with protecting the North Grove. That has always been our purpose. But we've learned there's a power here, Garrod. A power we've only just begun to understand. Okay. Winter is coming, and we haven't much time. Ah. Gregor Ven Fionn and Bjorn Sager Ven. Gregor Ven. Svealod Mopre Befasta. Befasta. Did you know him? Maybe I'm wrong, but you keep looking at him. <sighs> he was my friend. His name was Finn. He was here because of me. Let me I let him join when we left Castle Black. That was his choice. It's not your fault. Stop. Now his watch has ended. Oh, in Frieden, Finn. 
You fought well. For a crow. I saved your life. I wouldn't go that far. Although I admit, you can fight. Maybe they did teach you something at Castle Black. But then, my expectations were low. I fought worse. Is that right? Traitors and murderers at the Twins. Whites, far north of the Wall, when there were only three of us. And the man who killed my family. Killing them I don't mind. It's the burning that stays with you. You'll never forget that stench. Did you see what they just did? They don't care about their own. My sister has trained them well. Emotion is a weakness, according to her. There's something off about them. I'm not sure what. They've been trained to fight. Nothing else matters but that. They're more my sister's doing, not mine. The Whites grow bolder by the day. Ever since the Wildling tribes went south with Man's Raider. Are you all right? You don't look well. It's nothing. I'm fine. I should return to the village. Fulgor and Vicenir. Falcon, Vice and Weir. Did you not hear me? Fulgor and Suna! Hey! What? Wait! Fulgor and Vicenir. You're losing control. What was that? It's blood magic. The more she uses it, the weaker she becomes. And they can sense it. Elsa is a fool to keep taking these risks. One day, they'll kill us all if we're not careful. Is there some way to help her? She is convinced her blood magic is the only way to protect the North Grove. That her warriors are the answer. But she can't control it. I worry about her. It's more dangerous than she knows. She was right about one thing, though. The Whites are growing bolder. And the worst is yet to come. Now that my father's dead, there's no reason to stay. That's why he sent you, isn't it? To bring us back to Einrath. To crush our enemies south of the Wall. And avenge his death. We can't leave the North Grove. And stay here to die. Yeah. I'd rather live. You said yourself, House Forester is in danger. This is our chance to do something about it. Where's Sylvie? Never trust a fucking wildling. <laughs> 